are getting ready. All right, sending our camera guy out. National Anthem just wrapping up. All right, if you're watching the stream, let's uh, let's let's see if you guys can uh, shoot us a message in the comments. Uh, how's the audio? Are we coming through nice and clear? Let us know. Um, trying to just make the, make sure things are uh, come through nice and clear.
go. This is a. Trying to get through the got to go. Well, this is going to be a similar similar to a half pipe attack type of run run obstacle here. Run across these angled platforms onto the ninja leer. This is a swinging obstacle. Hands and feet are allowed. Trying to find the rhythm. Okay, you can use that bungee in the middle there to swing, get that momentum built back up. What comes down off of the platform, that is the start platform for the next obstacle as well, so that one's not going to count. Here we go on the geometry dash. A lot of different sh shapes here. Similar to the diamond dash. Oh no, coming down hot. Nice try. And then the last obstacles that you really got to go. Got several bars up there. A sideways throw and a ring chaser you're going to see here in one second. It's going to come down as soon as I get to a certain point. Oh, grab it onto the bars. And has to utilize the smaller ring. Can only use the V portion. Just short on a throw. And that's going to do it. Nice try. Okay, we're getting some uh, clarification on the rules uh, up there right now from uh, making sure the course judges are telling everybody the right way to go about uh, the course breakdown here. Getting a thumbs up from Max. Got Michael Scott on the course right now. Goes by the hilariously intense ninja. Going across the Godzilla lane. Climbing his way up for the gotta go. This is a new obstacle. And you've seen the maker ninja, Kevin Carbone, creates. You gotta grab and slashe right away. It does lock into that forward position. He's just a little shy of making that grab. Running across the angled platforms here. Latching on to that cat grab. Nice. Run across, climbing his way up. Oh, he's going to take a seated approach here on the ninja leer, the chandelier type structure, in order to get to that bungee. Oh, trying to find the rhythm. Grabbing hold, hold on tight. Doesn't weigh too much, so he's not going to swing too low. Thankfully, so he's got plenty of swing room. Oh, now he's got to try to get to the donut. Repositioning here. Almost getting there. Onto the pixie stick. And that's going to be time. And he's going to go ahead and... Wrap it up. Nice try, Michael Scott. Coming up now is going to be Noah Munier. Looks like he's getting his chalk ready to go. 
This is going to be a speed course here, this stage one. Only a minute 35 to get through as many of these obstacles as possible. Okay, looks like he's looks like he's starting to get ready to go. Make sure we're getting the course reset. Doing some rearranging out there, looks like, making sure. Oh, and we're off. He is on the move, Noah's going to take the King Kong way. Just go ahead and Kong over that box. Climb on up to the, got to go. Lachey right away into that next bar. Gets the clear right there, coming down off that trapeze bar. Running across the spinning pipe into the angled platforms. Nice cat grab technique into the chandeliers here. Does he opt to go down, down the low side? Lachey's right away. Oh, could have went for a quick dismount. But wanted to control that dismount because he cannot step off the platform once he lands on it. Until he engages that next obstacle, the pixie stick has to make a sharp right turn here. Excellent job. And now onto the geometry dash. Whoa, all the way across. Noah is setting the pace here. Nice moves all the way through. And not going to be able to keep up with the ring, sadly. But he's going to use the smaller ring. Can't use that black portion. Excellent aim. Straight to the bar, going for the dismount. And then there's the buzzer, our first clear. I believe that's going to be it. Yep, he got the smoke. Smoke going off will only happen whenever a full clear happens. So great job. No Munir getting through all eight obstacles with a clear time of 103.66. All right, guys, I'm back in. Had a little bit of audio issues there. Um, if you're in the chat, uh, just let us know if uh, everything's sounding good. We really appreciate the feedback, trying to make sure everything's good to go here for the rest of the day. Uh, but I'm going to be joining my buddy Strat on the commentary now. All right, up right now is Lila Nathanson. Goes by the Scrappy Ninja. Coming out of North Carolina, trains at the Rock Solid Warrior. And we're going to see how she does. She's been training Ninja for about a year now. And she recently got third place at the National Ninja League Worlds in 2021. And here she goes. Making her way through the stroll in the park. Which way does she decide to go here? Going along the Godzilla route. Yeah, taking the low route. Let's see how people react to this new obstacle here. The gotta go. Nice Lachey right away into the dismount. Great job. Making short work here. Oh, oh coming down off the slip pipe. Gonna keep moving here. Remember, they can have up to three fails on this first stage. Yeah, we'll see how she recovers here. Definitely looked like a hard fall there. Trying to get in a good position. Grabbing onto that bungee is gonna set her really low. But yeah, good she's transition. Go low here. She's got the dismount here if she wants it. Opting to go for that donut to assist with the landing. Good job. Better be safe than sorry, I suppose. Almost makes it to the clear platform. Geometry dash. Got to hit right dead center on these. Oh, gets her way through. Nice job. Got to go quick here. That ring is set and going down the track. There it, it is. Comes. It's going to be oh. just short. Grabbing the tuning fork ring here. Trying to set her swing straight. Don't You don't want those hips going off angle right away on the first swing forward. Here we go. Looking and for the dismount. Does she get there in time to clear it? I think we're going to just shy. A good run by the scrappy ninja. Lila Nathanson. Up next is going to be Jaden Sylvester.
Jaden Sylvester up next. Jaden's coming out of St. George, Utah. And goes by the Hearing Aid Ninja. It's been training Ninja for about four years and trains out of the grip. Awesome gym out there in Utah. So he's getting some uh, final words from uh, Mr. Max right there. And he was on this season of American Ninja Warrior, season 13. So let's see how he does here at Ninja Intensity, making his way through Stroll in the Park. Taking yeah, these those. athletes have a minute and 30 seconds to clear the course. Minute 35, I'm sorry. Strat with the correction. Nice high. Oh, almost went for the dismount there. Tries to get lined up. And those bars are in play. Anything you see with that white tape there. One, two, three. Smooth. Great. Dismount off the spinning pipe. A good time here. Just now under a minute to go. And I think the, the chandeliers here, the ninja leers, it's pretty time consuming because the swing can get off kilter really easy and really... Oh, he just lets go of the bungee and it gets hung up. He's going to have to lache this. Gets the transfer across. Grabs onto the donut, trying to make the dismount. Just, oh, too much momentum coming off of there. You have to slow this down. Other side. Geometry dash, just 10 seconds left. Oh, man, you can tell when you need to pick up the pace towards the end. Uh, really, really tricky balance obstacles. It's going to be challenging, especially when you start to try to rush in order to get through as many obstacles as you can with that time limit. All right, up next. Avery trains out of center court and has been training Ninja for about three years now. Competed on. Season 13 of A&W as well, and here she goes through strolling the park. Up right, and over the Kongs. Kongs. A lot faster there. Right away. Go. Oh, oh, no! Can she hang on? She's got the finger strength. This is going to be tough. Can utilize both sides, opting to go for a oh turnaround here. Smart way. It's in play. So that is allowed. Nice work. Making a cross. Not quite able to get the quick footwork across the spinning log. Moving now on to the Ninja Leers. Nice. Skips the bungee. Starting to build that swing back up. Never mind about the... Uh, Got to go from previous obstacle that was not going to count for, but she's onto the pixie stick here. Nice and slow and controlled. Great job. That thing spins really easy into Geometry Dash. Oh, just not quite able to get the footwork there. And that's going to do it for Avery. actually so you can only utilize that front side of the gotta go 
That obstacle is intended to force a lache right away. You got to dismount right away off of that. That's why it locks in that ending position, kind of cause you to peel out on the back swing, make it much more difficult. All right, we got uh, a Bryson Clark on the course right now, coming out of Utah. Trains at the grip as well. And here we go, all the way through Stroll in the Park. Takes the Kong, the Kong route. Good Lachey down on the gotta go and right away transfers off. Steady those hips for the dismount. Clear all the way through. And we need a little speed here. One, two, three, onto the warp wall. Great job. Ah, but can't oh, that's hang okay. on. For the traction required on the steep, the steep angle there. Making good time right now. Only, you know, 30 seconds. She's got a minute left. A couple more obstacles. Nice, nice skip Lachey there. Cross. Trying to work around now. Might twist that chandelier nice in order to get to the donut for the dismount. So you got to go slow on the pixie stick here because you have to make that sharp turn. Nice control, but oh. steps back. I think that's might have been a clear. We'll have to get some confirmation. But across the geometry dash, ah, just stepped down off of the third platform. Just a little time left here for the really got to go obstacle. That first bar sets the ring down the track. Here she comes. See you coming. On to sideways. Here she comes. Oh, oh, just shy. Trying to make the Lachey across. Nice, but can't you get the dismount in time? Uh, not quite able to get run. Let's go ahead and take a quick look at our sponsors while our next runner is coming up. Got a lot of sponsors for this competition. Amazing. They were able to You can see Zimra Biomed, ProLift, Humble, Midstream. Uh, we'll be going over these a lot through the day, but just thank you to all of these sponsors for on the course right now coming out of Steel City Ninja training four years one of his biggest ninja accomplishments is uh, skipping rungs on the salmon ladder and he, he enjoys in his spare time a big drop there nice high drop down around the pillars finding his path here on to the split decision Often to go on to these smaller platforms to cross through. Nice work. Up here. Oh, the got to go. Got to get those hips back behind you. And oh. just not able to get the transfer up to the next bar. Quick feet. One, two steps. Woo, big jump. Nice work. Starts his little cat shimmy across. On to the shanty. Okay, skip that bar, skip the bungee as it were. He's got a lot of swing here. Does he go for the dismount or the donut? Grabs the donut. Nice control. All right, William, let's see. Good control on the balance. Nice work. William's doing great work here. Cross the diamond dash. Does he save it? Not quite able to just had his hips too far forward lean back a little too much it's gonna be his first fall that's gonna be his time gotta move quick gotta be efficient calculated when you're out there yeah I mean this is a tight time limit for these athletes they gotta move it's not easy Yeah, it 
was ad advertised as a challenging, challenging course. So these competitors know what they signed up for. Time crunch is going to be an obstacle in itself. Let's see how we do for the next competitor. Right now we've got, we've got James Zanella on the course right now. Coming out of center court in Lawrence. Although we're already through strolling apart, going across the King Kong box. And let's see, he's got that Sen City shirt on, so we'll probably try to send this no problem. On the shade, nice work coming through. And he gets a quick dismount. Trying to stride across those pipes. Can't grab his way across. Good pace here. Going to get a little twist of the hips to try. Dismount, great control here. Just at a minute remaining. He's got to slow it down a little bit on the pixie stick. Good right now, though. Nice job. Geometry down. He's got the time. Hopping through all these moves here. Can he catch the ring? Nice. Caught it. Nice work. Nice. First one to do so. Gets the transfer across. Come on, James. You got it. And bar to Awesome work. Nice work, James. Up next will be Gary Park. Heading up to the platform. Goes by Scary Gary. Coming out of St. Louis, Missouri. Out of the danger zone. Let's see how Gary, Scary Gary does out here at the Bucket of Chalk Comp. And here he is now strolling through the park. Oh, coming down. A little too hot on the pad, I think. I'll have to double check, but he's cross King Kong now into Gotta Go. Oh, but that backside's not in play. Yeah, they made an announcement also that you cannot use that backside. Trying to cross. Good. Chandelier time. Does he go for the bungee? He does. Got to. Who's going to wail Ooh, a little bit? keep those bit. feet up. I know. Good lock off strength in order to keep those legs up away from the padding. Grab on the donut. Just has to steady his swing a little bit. It's a controlled dismount. Starts looking for the pixie stick. That thing spins real fast. Good job, makes it through. On the geometry dash here. Whoa, not able to get all the way through. That second one tripped him up. And that's going to be his three and done. Nice try, Gary. Well, Bucket of Chalk is raising awareness for breast cancer, so make sure uh, you check out what they're doing. Check out the merch table if you're here right now, um, but make sure you check out online and support what they're doing for breast cancer. It's really amazing. Right, we got Christian Yost up on the course right now, the dark horse, 17 years old, coming out of Dallas, Texas. Trains out of the gauntlet, has been training for nine years. Really enjoys classic video games. Was on American Ninja Warrior Season 13 this season. And American Ninja Warrior Jr. So he's no stranger to all the ninja competitions. All the way through, strolling the park, going across the King Kong boxes. And to got to go here. Good shake. Can he get it? Not oh. quite able. Didn't have his hips behind him. But he's not letting that phase him. He's already through the shark tooth into the ninja leers. Nice little toe hook there. Pulls back. Grabs onto the second one. 
little off angle, but still able to get a good control dismount. Nice job, Christian. Slowing it down now. Got to slow it down for this spinning pixie stick. Nice save into Geometry Dash. One, two, three, four. Oh my gosh, just went for it and cleared it. Coming up with just about 30 seconds left. Nice blinking Lachaise here. Oh, he had it in hand and just missed. Here he goes. He's going to go ahead and pull. Probably throw right away. Plenty of time left. And there it is, time. Honestly, a really sloppy run from Christian. Usually he's a lot more clean than that. I think with the with the time factor uh, in play, these athletes are just trying to push the pace when they can. But still making it through a fair amount of those obstacles. Nice job, Christian. Michael Bellion's on the course right now. His nickname is uh, Not Applicable Ninja. Coming out of Long Island, New York. Trains out of the Freeport Ninja Academy. He's got about two years of Ninja under his belt. And we'll see how he does. Got second in the Adults National Ninja League Worlds 2021 just this season. Let's see how Michael does. He said he just recently shaved his head because his barber wasn't answering his calls. <laughs> so he's got a fresh haircut. Oh, false start here. Oh, got to wait for the 3 2 1 go. Sure Michael's a little fired up today. A little fired up. A little. He's at the ready and he's off. Strolling through the park. Opting for the King Kong route. Into the gotta go. Keeping those hips back in order to get that lache technique down. Nice and smooth across the shark tooth pipe. Oh, but he's slipping a little bit. Up and over. Into the Ninja Leers we go. Lachey's right away into the donut. Great transition. That's going to be probably the most efficient we've seen so far. Trying to steady these hips to get that controlled landing right there on the ledge. Nice job, Michael. And to the pixie stick. Slowing it down now. Just under a minute to go. And a little too far oh. to one side. That's going to be his first fail, I believe. And now across Geometry Dash. Saves it. We got the ring chaser. 35 seconds. Moving quick. Nice matches into. And let's see if he's got to wait for it oh, here. Plenty oh. of time, but he loses track of where it was at. He's looking <laughs> at the wrong direction. But using the smaller ring, no problem. Still some time to spare. Good, strong pull in order to get to the dismount hitting that buzzer. Nice job, Michael. Nice. Got John Mack on the platform right now, getting ready to run. John Mack got that Reach T-shirt on, meaning he probably's got a huge wingspan, which will come into play on some of these obstacles. Competitors with a longer wingspan can just sometimes take those shortcuts when needed, so that can really work to their advantage.
for the King Kong ball. Oh, nice little safe, uh, quick speed ball across the top. Can't use feet on that box. Going for the Lachey. Got to go, no problem. Quick feet here for... Nice job. Oh, slips a little bit. Staying nice and controlled here into the Ninja Leers. Use that, that reach. wingspan. Got that reach. No need to Lachey whatsoever. Ooh, but too much, too much pressure down onto the pixie stick. Geometry dash, nice and centered. No problem. Didn't look like he stuttered at all there. And will he go monkey bar method? He's Lachey through hand to hand, side to side. Not quite able to get the ring. Go ahead and grab onto that secondary one. Tuning fork time. Pull him back. Gets the transfer across. And once again, just static holds. There we go. No problem. Great run. Just a little, little slip up coming off of the pixie stick platform at the start there. Hopefully that time will stick for him, making it that top 50%. Moving on now for our next competitor. Somebody we know very oh well over my here. Goodness. <laughs> Ethan Swanson, ladies and gentlemen, on the platform right now. The Daredevil Ninja. Flap those arms. Get the crowd going. Get them hyped up. Give Ethan him Swanson. the swan stomp. Coaching out here at Ninja Intensity. Living out here in Colorado now. Long-time competitor on American Ninja Warrior. Known for his speed, his crane scaling abilities, all sorts of daredevil-type escapades. And hopping in, let's see how he does. Shouldn't be a problem through the platforms there. Strolling the park up and over the Kong box. No hands or feet needed. Into the gotta go right away. Pulls back. Gets the shade across. Already positioned himself into that. Angled shark teeth run. No hands, no cat grabs. Gets a good push. Tries to get that chandelier swinging. Nice lache into the donut right away. Good efficiency here. Oh, pixie stick transition. Smooth. No problem. Whoa, fast footwork. Nice job, Swan. And can he go through fast enough to grab the ring? Sideways, here it comes. He sees it. Oh, oh. but he swipes it away. Nice try, Ethan. Here he goes for the tune-in for Job on the transfer. And the bar and the buzzer. And he gets the smoke full clear. Flap those arms, everybody. Mr. Swanson. Nice job, Ethan. <laughs> there by Swan. Let's take a quick push to the leaderboard. Ethan Swanson on the right-hand side. You can see in first place, eight points. Noah Muner in second. James. And we're getting ready for our next runner. So just a quick look here. And and Jackson's on the way right now, running through Stroll in the park. And here it also goes. Nice little kickback right away. Good Lache coming in hot. Frost. Yet another Sen City athlete. Ooh, Pixie. Manages to fall into the next platform, going across Geometry Dash. Oh, not able to get there. Nice try. Ring as it's coming down. Great transitions. Plenty of time here, but not able to grab the ring. Crossing across. Nice little shot. And hit, it, hit, it, hit, it, hit, it. Hit, hit the buzzer. Don't forget to hit the buzzer. There you go. To end. Nice work. This 
is a tough course. I'll be running this. So, we're we'll getting all the beta from everybody. <laughs> Best as I can. Oh, I just like to make it through a one piece. Our next competitor at the platform, ready to go. Alex Real. Getting ready to run. This is hard because fast players. Can't believe it. Goes by four real ninja. Up and over the Kong box. And into gotta go. Looking for the Lachey here. Oh, not able to get the right. Quite get that one either. Those are steep platforms. Let's see, you can only fail one more time. Try to get those hips back. Going straight into the donut. So far, so good on that one. Into Pixie Stick. Ooh. Out from underneath you if you're not careful. Alex, nice try. Shot of the crowd here. Everybody's enjoying the show. He's hanging out, enjoying. Things set back. Sure, we'll be ready to run in just a second. Let's go, Isaac. going to be so we got Isaac on the course right now Isaac Jackson going to be his coach walking alongside make sure he gets through the Kong box nice work climbing up let's see how these lighter competitors fare on the gotta go it's going to be a big lache. Hips back, catches. Isaac. That's good. So got to have fancy footwork here. Ah, not enough speed. Starts looking for the transfer. Can utilize those bars. On to the chandelier here. across the bungee can't quite hold on try to fix it Don't let go yet come on fight for it for the time that reach when the whole structure rotates you around out of position done gets the high five from his coach Nice try. This is going to be a much. That is not slowing them down in the slightest. Nice try, Isaac. Up next, we got Pax Karslaw. on the platform, ready to go. He's looking out on the course, making sure he's got his path figured out, hopping in, and he's off onto Stone Park. Going around, finding that dismount, nice work. Into the gotta go. Lining up this lache here. Hips got to be back. Nice work. Gets the transfer down. Clears on. Got to go across the pipe into Shark Teeth. Ooh, a little bit of a slip, but catches on, holds on. Smart work there, being aware of those slippery platforms. 
into the chandeliers. Momentum back up in order to get to the donut reach. Good timing for the Got to slow it down just a little bit here. Just under a Into Geometry Dash. One, two, three. Falling forward. Gets the clear. Trampoline. That ring's going to be a little far forward in front of him. It's all right. Just around 35 seconds remaining. Plenty of time. Does he have the grip left? Good job. Gets the dismount and the buzzer. Nice job from Mr. Pax Carslaw. Uh, proud of his uh, student champions. And here he goes now on you know, strolling the park, working his way through these boxes, hopping his way down. Which path is he going to take? Take the balance route, Godzilla route. Can he be one of our smaller competitors get through? they got to go. Big Lachey back. Not quite able to get the toss up, but that's okay. Right away through the shark teeth. Reset on this just so he can get that point for the Ninja Lear here. Nice transition across. Good Lachey. He's going to try to time this rotation around to grab the donut. Keeps his momentum and gets the dismount onto the pixie stick. Ah, you can't grab onto the safety barrier there. That is there to slow you down. That's going to do it. That's going to do it for him. Nice try, Caleb. Obstacles are going to be really tough to do when you're trying to rush. If you have a slip up earlier on, you've got to be able to redeem it. At some point in time, it's really, really challenging when you're out there in the heat of the moment. Running the course is going to be on to got to go. Oh, just not able to get the Lachey onto. They got to go grab there, running through, shark teeth. Climb up. Gets on to the bottom portion of the chandelier. Lachey's right away. Makes it. Great timing. Let's see if the bare feet are just going to help her out on the transition on the pixie stick. Got one more chance here. Can't have any more mistakes across Geometry Dash. Coming out of Ninja Street down there in Miami. Trying to get the timing just right here. Coming down on the front side of that platform. It's going to spin. It's going to rotate. Nice try, Cecilia. Good try. Good try. Platform now is going to be Kevin Rodriguez. Let's see what his plan of attack is going to be. For the stroll in the park. Max making sure the course is good to go. Mm -hmm. 
Kevin is on. Ooh, big drop down, up and over, no need to go. Hips back, shades right away. Great technique for the dismount. Right away into the short teeth. Ooh, might be close on the on the slide there. It's going to be slippery when you make that transition, but he's going to keep on going. Grabbing on to the bottom portion of the chandeliers. Moving through. He's got to slow it down now. Making great time. Good transitions. Had his body in the right face and direction across. Geometry dash. Oh, no. Came down. Too hot. Just a little short on the second step. Not going to let him be phased by it too much. Still moving really quick here. Going to be there in time. Grab the ring, but not quite able to get the timing. Utilizing this smaller one up and over. Plenty of time remaining. Good save there. Had to match back onto the tuning fork hold. One-handed dismount and slap that buzzer. Nice try. Kevin Rodriguez got through the majority of them. Jump to dash. Caught him off guard a little bit, but still. Good run. Coming up next is uh, Mazaya Andrade coming out of Woodbridge, New Jersey. Trains out of center court. Lawrence going on three years for Ninja. And he was on season two of American Ninja Warrior Jr. Mazaya, let's see how he does here. Rocking that GBW shirt. He's chalked up, ready to go. And off onto Stroll through the park here. Hopping around. Clear. Calling it over the box. First couple obstacles just there to get that heart rate up into. Gotta go. Does he have the lache? Oh, good grip. Great grip. Able to maintain on that backswing across shark teeth. Still smooth through it. Come on, let's go onto the chandelier here. Lining up the transfer, going through the low route. The shades across. Good work. Slowing down just a little bit. Trying to maintain that swing. Good work for the dismount. Nicely done. Now comes the tricky pixie stick. Yeah, that's all right. Only the first one. He's got two more left. Geometry dash. Nice try, man. That's those are catch you. That second one's been catching people every uh, every time. They just short change that step. And final obstacle here. Really got to go. Getting those lachets. Not quite able to catch the ring. Just a little bit behind it. On now for the team fork throw. Transfer, transfer just a little high. Nice try, Messiah. That's going to do it for him. platform right now is going to be Vance Walker coming out of Atlanta, Georgia. He's undefeated on the American Ninja Warrior first two seasons. Didn't compete this year on American Ninja Warrior Jr. because he was old enough to be on the big show, actually on a &W primary, making it all the way to stage three his first ever season. Here he goes through Stroll in the Park. Let's see if he can make it through all of these stages here today and tomorrow. Taking the Kong box up and over. Good throws. Pulls really hard on the forward on the forward swing. The balance is something he sometimes struggles with, but not this time. Good save on the slip there. Making his way up. Good control. He's going to probably pick up the pace here for the upper body portion. He's got power for days. Good transition to the donut. Controls the landing. Once again, balance. 
Wiping those shoes, making sure he's going to have good traction. Stepping on to the pixie stick. See, he's just being a little hesitant here. Wants to make sure he's got good control. Low center of gravity. Leaning towards the platform, just shy. That's all right. Cross diamond dash, yet another bounce obstacle. One, two, three, four. Nice dive roll there. And you really got to go here on the final obstacle. Popping his way through. Does he catch it? Plenty. And he's got it. Plenty of time there. Back pull gets the, tro uh, gets the toss. Uh, just one, I believe, on the pixie stick. Spun out from underneath him. Nice run, Vance. Let's see if it's going to hold up throughout the day. Top 50% of later today. Seventh place, Vance Walker taking ninth place with that run. A lot more action to go. All right, Mr. Scott on the course right now. Running through. To got to go. Good transitions. Great pace here. Working through the shark teeth. Two steps on the spinning pipe. Nice save. Not letting the steep platform slow him down here. Into the chandeliers. Twist in order to get that momentum built back up in the right direction. Good controlled landing. Pixie stick here trick. We've seen. Go nice and controlled. Keep those get it, get it, feet in one direction. Sometimes works. Not going to pan out for him there. Geometry dash. Oh, my gosh. Oh, just not. He's got one more to go here on the sideways. Go ahead and grab onto that smaller ring. Gets the transfer across. Building that momentum up just a little more in order to get to the bar. Just a couple slip-ups. Hopefully that last time will stand for the remainder of the day. Thumbs up to the camera. Nice run. I want to thank everybody for tuning in today. We'll be live streaming all the day long. Like I said earlier, we had 150. You know we're moving at a quick pace here. Let's see who do we have on the course coming up. But thank you again, everybody, for tuning in for the live stream. Jump in the chat. Cheer on the competitors. Ask questions. We'll do our best to respond as best we can. Eight obstacles. Time limit of one minute and 35. Of course, designed by Max and Caden. Here, Bucket of Chalk 2.0. Getting all the ins and outs figured out. Yes. And here we go with our next competitor running. Right now, we've got Jaden Welch striding his way through. Stroll in the park and King Kong box, no problem. Into, gotta go. Keeps his hips back. Nice lache across. Here he goes now on shark teeth. One, two, three. Good save on the ascent. Climbing his way up into the Ninja Leers. Trains out of Flow Vault there alongside Lauren Ball. Nice lache across. Often to go on to the opposite end here of the chandelier that can be a little tricky because it's just going to spin right back into your start position but he gets the momentum needed to get to the donut nice work here we go now on the slower obstacle the pixie stick taking 
that time. Good control. And geometry dash. Got to sprint through these short changes. That second one, again, it's been the second one catching people off guard. That's his first fail. Moving on now to the really got to go. He's got to start, start hopping his way through here in order to get to that ring. You can see it's just going to get there before he does. But still unfazed. Moving on to a smaller ring. Mm -hmm. Trying to straighten those hips. Eyeing that transfer. Nice. Good work. Ten seconds. Get to the bar. Gets to the bar and the buzzer. I believe just one slip there off of the diamond dash. Uh, altered version there, the geometry dash. Nice work. Mr. J. First competitor, Noah Jones, on the platform right now, coming out of Concord, California. Goes by Ninja Noah. Trains out of a Traverse Fitness in Squadron. Hello. Seen him out there, training alongside Brian Kretsch, Sean Bryan, Alan Keneally, the West Coast crew. It's good to see all sorts of competitors out here from all over the country. Noah Jones getting ready to run here. Got through stage one at the NNL Worlds. Over the Kong box, he goes into, got to go here at Lachey, his way to victory. Mount onto Shark Teeth, one, two, across, spinning log, grabbing onto that angle platform. Making quick cat grabs up. Let's see what his plan of attack here is going to be. He's going to go the high route. Nope, just going to do a quick heel hook. It's a nice heel hook to get the bar closer. Transition, making sure. This shit. Oh, that's all right. Quite a save there. Good save. Don't want to come off that platform. In platform of one, start platform of the other. Taking his time across the pixie stick, but turns the hips away from the platform. It's going to be his first fail. Cross geometry dash. No, coming in hot. Not letting that stop him. Still going to keep pushing through. Oh, there it goes. Just not able to keep up with it. Noah looking for the throw here. Gets the move. Now he's looking for the dismount or the bar. Which one he's going to go for. Grabs onto the bar. Quick back. Good job, Noah. Let's see if we can go back to that replay here. Transition, making sure he's got the swing here. For the save. Lands a little oh! too much metal. Oh, that's <laughs> all right. Good work. Noah Jones. Oh. Happens when you got to push the pace. These, these narrow landings, if it's a end platform of one obstacle, start platform of the other, they have to stick the landings. They cannot dismount. The Scent City. Shirt. We're seeing some. Uh, we're, seeing, we're seeing some cool shirt designs out here. Every ninja seems to logo and design nowadays. All right. Up next. Just got clarification. The pixie sticks a a feet only obstacle, so the hands on there won't count for Mr. Noah. Sorry about that. But David on the course right now. Running his way through. Coming out of Lafayette, Col uh, Colorado. King Kong box. 
looking to got to go. Ninja Nation. In the Lafayette location. No problem on the got to go. Coming. Approach. Just can't. You see how much that pipe spins there on the dolly? Wheels not forgiving. In we go now on to the Ninja Lear. Chandeliers. He's swinging a little bit all over the place, but he steadies himself between the two. He's a taller competitor, so he's going to have to just try to get that swing just right. Nice save. But coming up on just 35 seconds remaining here. Can he get across the Pixie staff? Some, some clarification here. Clarification there. You know, I think that's going to do uh, it for I David. Nice try, I think man. He, did he hit the fall maximum? I believe so. Yep, that's going to do it for David. Up next, we have uh, Luke Dillon. I think he's heading up to the platform here in just a second. Dylan getting ready to run, Sen City athlete. Make sure he's getting all of the instructions cleared by the coaching staff here. Look at the chalk crew, making sure the course is reset. Everything's cleaned up. With competition called the bucket of chalk, you can expect a whole lot of chalk all over the place. So you see Isabella up there making sure <laughs> the start platform is going to be good to go. <laughs> Cleaning things off for our competitors who are chalking their hands up, but in doing so, sometimes sabotage uh, their own runs, having that chalk slip down onto a feet-only obstacle for later in the course. can be real challenging. Let's, uh, look at our sponsors there. Again, yeah, huge thank you to our sponsors. You know, we want to shout out Ninja Masters, for, you know, providing the scoring system here, the, all the graphics, the timing you see, that's from uh, Ninja Master app. Go ahead to their website, and you can follow the competition along live. Ninja Masters registration score system takes the obstacles out of running a competition. Whether you're running a spontaneous course with a few ninjas, a multi-stage competition like this one, or an entire league, master everything you need. And Luke is ready to go. Luke Dillon on the course all the way through Stroll in the Park. Going to try to get through a different route here, it looks like. Hopping his way through over to Kong Box. King Kong done. And they got to go right away. Good moves. Quick work of the first three obstacles into Shark Teeth. Strides across. Begins his ascent. Get to that bar is going to be a clear for the Shark Teeth. Into the Ninja Leers. Lachey's across the base there. Onto the donut. Good landing. He's going to slow it down for this feet-only obstacle, the pixie stick. Oh, kind of pre-position yourself so if you do start to fall, you fall towards that platform. Good job. Oh, <laughs> what a save. Got to stay centered on the geometry dash. One, two, three, four. Dives into it. Gets the thumbs up. Excellent save. Can he make it to the ring? Cross sideways. Good moves there. And grabs the ring midair. Nice work. Goes for the ring toss. Oh! Just short on the move across. Wow. That's going to do it. Let's Man, see if he... we can cut to that. Just came Look short. Look at this save right here. Coming across the pixie stick. Hops to the corner. Oh! Wow, nice work. Really good save there. Good. Nice job, nice job, Luke. All right, moving on to our 34th competitor.
All right, up next we got Wally, Ross Kelly. Better to number 34. Getting ready to go here in just a second. And off we go on Stroll in the Park. Up and over we go. Kong Box, no problem. And it got to go here. Gotta line up this Lachey just right. Ooh, not quite able to hold on. Nice try. Across the Shark Tooth, not able to get to the warp wall there to begin his ascent, but he's going to climb up and see if he can make it through the remaining portion of the course without any slip-ups. Can't have any more mistakes here. He's got two so far, and on to the pixie stick. Taking that sideways motion. Good save. Makes it through. Geometry dash. Forward. <laughs> Just not able to get there off of that tipping platform. And nice that is going to do it for Wally. <laughs> Still had a lot of fun out there. That's what it's all about. You got to have a good time when you're competing, or else it's going to be really stressful. Platform hey. even better. All right, coming up now on the platform is going to be the Sunflower Ninja, Kayla Citadino. Coming out of Thornton, Colorado. Trains at the Flow Vault. It's been uh, training Ninja for about two years now. And took second place in the Colorado Colorado League Finals in her first year competing. And here she goes through Stroll in the Park. Making her way around. Looking for the dismount. Nice job, Kayla. Going through the Godzilla route here. Balance path stepping through nice and controlled on to gotta go does she Lachey up oh, oh can't quite hold on such a tough move there all right into and shark teeth you gotta go fast on the spinning log here one two three just gonna go ahead and skip past those first two to climb up for the Ninja Lear. She's got one last chance here to try to get a get through these last few obstacles. See her plan of attack going through the low route. Building up the swing. Let's the spin take her a little closer. Nice transition. It's gonna start doing the same thing here again. It's gonna let the spin take her closer up to the donut for the drop down. And nice superhero landing there. <laughs> Four. Oh, just oh, not quite didn't full make on. It. Must have stepped back off of the platform. Nice try, Kayla. Just a few more competitors in this first wave. Up next, we've got Harry Haldeman. Headband Harry. He's going to be coming up to the course soon. All right, Harry, it's getting ready to go. He's getting, the, getting a little more ambiance. Somebody set the mood with all the uh, with all the smoke at the start there. All right, Harry, headband Harry, rocking through, strolling the park. Coming out of Denver, Colorado, trains here at Ninja Intensity, so this is his home gym. So a lot of this stuff you might be familiar with already. No problem through the first two obstacles. And looks for the Lachey on to gotta go. Wants to make sure these hips are a little further back. Oh, but does he, he have, have to the, hold on here? He locks it in at a low point. Nice work. Not a bad way to try to fight his way through. On to Shark Teeth. Quick footwork. Nice reach onto the ascent. Come on, Harry. Starts climbing his way up. Using his feet here, I like this. Getting able, getting the reach. Big swing. Good swing. Nice transition right away. 
sticks the landing. Now it's time for that pixie stick. Going across. Great control. Geometry dash time. Not much run up to get that speed you need. Oof. Okay. Gets it. Got through the, the plane for the landing platform onto the really got to go. Will he be able to catch that ring as it's coming down? That backswing might not get him to it in time. Oh, I think he jumped to the second. I don't know if the ring. Ring got hung up. I'm not sure what happened there. He's going to get uh, a reset. Getting a reset here. I think what happened was he moved too quick to release the ring. Uh, I see. Oh, not able to get there in time. He's going to go ahead and opt for the of the ring. It is available, thankfully. Chucks it across the gap. On, Harry, you got it. And gets to the dismount. Nice. And gets the buzzer. Job there, Harry. That's a good job. Great work, headband Harry. Run Final few compared. You can see we got a full house in here. The next wave is warming up in the warm-up zone. Everybody's starting to get loose. Making sure they're gonna be ready to fire on all cylinders. Here we go, Phil Folsom. Yeah, this is a run that I'm really excited to watch. Phil Folsom, you see him train with his brother Sam. These kids are absolute monsters. They train out of their barn outside of St. Louis, and the stuff that they put up is just absolutely wild. This is definitely going to be a fun. Place in the pro division at the Jungle Gym competition. Loves to do crazy stunts on obstacles. I've seen them on their obstacles at their barn doing some impressive stuff right now he's already through the first two obstacles great job gotta go shouldn't be any problem here his lache strength is really good and two shark teeth one two steps no problem and going for that can't grab tech climbing up rocking the strikes no strike shoes no problem on the lache it's got but he's got to slow it down here for the pixie stick and Ooh, oh. not able to make it across. That's all right. Into geometry dash. Oh my gosh. It's going to be close. Car sets the ring down the track. Here it comes. You can see it. Oh, oh my gosh. Almost had it. Let's see if you can get this timing down. Up and over. Still a really good pace. Just the pixie stick that hung him up there. Hopefully that time sticks for the rest of the day. We'll see him run later on. Yeah, let's see if we can pull up that leaderboard right now. Um, you can see Ethan Swanson still in first place. Noah, James Sanella. Don't know if Phil Folsom's run has come in just yet. Phil Folsom only with six points, uh, 14th place there. Had a couple misses. All right. Just a few runners remaining. We've got our final two here. Let's see if we're about ready to go. Ninja Intensity out here in Castle Rock, Colorado. If you're in the Colorado area, please swing by. This is a awesome facility to train out with some experienced uh, competitors from the show and just in general that have been training Ninja all around. If you're traveling from out of town, I highly recommend that you try to get in town a few days early in order to acclimate to that altitude. I know it hit me really hard that first day I was here. That altitude sickness is no joke. Just like this obstacle course today, minute 35 for the first stage definitely challenging got to have a good pace going through i believe our next competitor is ready to go we got brett strong 
on the start platform right now. And here he goes, running his way through. Coming out of rock solid in North Carolina. Through Stroll in the Park. Kong's over that box. Season. Strong competitor here, making his way through. Got to go no problem onto the Shark Teeth. Setting a really good pace here. Into the Ninja Lear. Ooh, almost had a little miss there, but not phased by it whatsoever. Maintaining that momentum and slowing down the dismount for the Pixie Stick. Here for the transition. Hips get a little sideways, but he's able to save it. Quick one any turn on the Geometry Dash. Oh, my gosh. Oh, he gets, gets a little hung up there. No ball. Cross the got to really got to go sideways into it. Does he catch the ring? Waiting for it, misses it, but going on to the V hold here. Up and over, looking for the fastest time of the day, potentially. Checking the ankle, making sure he's okay. Great run, Brett Strong. And there is the smoke. That means a full clear for him. Awesome work. Strong competitor. It's in his name, Brett Strong. Our last runner, Brady Parks, is up. On the stream and then sh come back at uh, for our next wave. Brady Parks on the platform getting ready to go. Three and a half years under his belt for being a ninja. This course looked like a stroll in the park with a little car. <laughs> to go swing here. See his technique. Ooh, good grab. Big lash. That, that pipe didn't even budge. Coming across the box. Coming on the chandelier. And making his way down onto the pixie sticks. Brady, Ooh. too much lean back on the side there. Three and not his hand cool. might have come down there. Bounce platform underneath you. Really got to go. Catching the ring even. Not many. Off the bar into the platform. You got to hit the buzzer. Got to hit the buzzer. You got to hit the buzzer. Oh, he's got to stop his time there. <laughs> yeah, we'll see if his hand... Counted for him, but yeah, I don't know. I think his hand nice did try come break. down. Have about 10 minutes before our next wave gets going, so let's take a quick. So much to our sponsors here. Um, there are so many. We got uh, Humble, Humble Midstream, Ninja Master, Copeland Precast, Whipfly, Castle Rock Autoplex, Zimmer Biomet. MB Roofing, McDonald's of Castle Rock, Our Way Pools, Bar S, Castle Rock Family Physician, Biagi Bros, Castle Rock Microwave, Air and Company, Stronghold, Colorado Foot and Ankle, and Pro Lift Crane, and also Safeway Grocery Store for providing some produce and groceries for our athletes today. Just a huge thank you to our sponsors. You can see how many people were involved in helping to put on this event and helping make sure that these athletes were taken care of. And so we absolutely appreciate it. Tune in to our upcoming live streams. Um, to hear more about our sponsors, we'll go into some more detail. But we've got some more. We've got some more streams coming up. Uh, we've got one starting in about 10 minutes. We're going to close down the stream. I know we had a little bit of lag issues. We're going to try to fix that for our next stream. But uh, yeah, thanks for coming out, guys, and uh, we'll see you soon.